What's up guys, welcome back to another video, this is Xenios Kralambos and if you are new to my channel make sure you subscribe and if you are already a subscriber make sure you turn on notifications by hitting the bell right under this video. So in this video I'm going to discuss about a topic that was raised in my previous video. So while I was doing my previous video someone in the comment section asked me why do I train for 25 minutes because at some point on the video I mentioned that I train for only 25 minutes per day which this is true by the way if you are wondering what am I doing uh, basically I'm training every single day for just 25 minutes I don't like to go for two hours in the gym I don't like to stay for one hour because I'm a very busy person and I don't have time to train for such a long time so for me 25 minutes is the best timing and it's enough to complete a full workout so if you watch my webinar which basically i teach you exactly how to build a fitness model body without cutting out sweets desserts and chocolates at some point i mentioned that you can only train for three times per week and still see amazing results and also you can train for seven times per week and still see the same results so basically uh, when it comes to a training program what matters first of all is the frequency and the second of all is the volume and intensity. So when it comes to training three times per week, then basically what you need to do is you need to increase your volume and intensity. And for those of you that you don't know what volume and intensity is, is basically the sets and repetitions that you do for each exercise. So if let's say that you want to train for three times per week, then you are going to need to increase your volume and intensity, and probably you will need more than one hour to complete the workouts. If you want from the other side and you don't have time to train and you want to train for only 25 minutes to 30 minutes per session, then basically you need to do more frequency and then you have to decrease your volume and intensity. So this is how exactly this principle work. So in this workout that you see right now, which basically is a back workout, it's a very quick back workout by the way, I only train for maybe 27 minutes. I'm not sure exactly for how long, but I think it was 27 minutes. So personally, I train seven times per week. That means every single day for 25 minutes. And basically I train one muscle per day. I know many of you may say that, oh my God, your program is a pro science program. Uh, no, <laughs> to be honest, my program is probably, I think is one of the best programs that you can follow. That doesn't mean that it's going to work for you because when it comes to my program, I designed it myself and I tested many programs before and I know very well that the program that I'm following right now is working very well on me. So some of my clients, they also use similar style program like myself and they see amazing results. So just to clarify again, I only train for 25 minutes, but I train every single day. So that means I have more frequency, but less volume and intensity. So if you want to know more, about these techniques that I'm using, I really encourage you to watch my webinar because I explain everything step by step about how to start your transformation. So if you want also to get my beginner's fitness guide, which is currently on my website and is selling at 37 pounds, I'm giving this away for free if you watch my webinar and you stay until the end of my webinar. So I encourage you to go and watch my webinar because you will learn a lot of things and a lot of tricks like the one that I taught you right now so go watch that and if you are new to my channel make sure you subscribe if you don't follow me on my social media make sure you follow me there on my instagram and on my snapchat and make sure guys that you hit a like in this video and if you have any questions comment them in the comment section below i always reply to everyone and i'm going to see you again on the next video thank you so much So the secret to improve your waist to back ratio is to train shoulders. That's why I love training shoulders. And also by training shoulders, it shows that basically you are a man because by having big shoulders, that means you have a very good testosterone level. So that's another secret that I would like to give you. So the first exercise that I always...